Welcome back to a game for thoughts. We just beat Razor Fist. Um, and we're gonna get killed by these three scorpion dudes. Unless I can shell shock them. Ah, shell shock for the win. Ooh, maybe we'll get some nice health up here in this box. But knowing this game, yep, there we go. It's like, I doubt that. But hey, our attack is up. Could have really used that against Razor Fist. But whatever. It's fine. It's just an attack. Alrighty. I almost feel like I want to switch my character so that I don't keep hearing the same lines over and over again. But I've gotten used to Donatello's attacks. And Donatello is my favorite. So, like, at this point, switching characters would be kind of lame. But also, at the same time, Donatello is my favorite. So, I think we'll stick with Donatello. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Adventure, I guess. Woohoo, we finished the level. It only took us one minute. Just kidding, that took a long time. That, that was a long level. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, let's see where we at now. Abandoned town. Genetic labs and culmination room. Something, cultivation room? I don't know. Well, we don't have very many levels left, but I feel like I don't think we're gonna make through with three lives. We'll see what happens. Oh boy, okay. Isn't this the mark of the Foot Clan? Good job, Leonardo. What else can you tell us? What could that mean? Maybe they were here. I'm not sure. Okay, they okay. Somehow be connected with those monsters that keep attacking us. Good thought, Donatello. You think those monsters are Foot Clan members? Good thought, Donatello or Michelangelo. You'll have to investigate. Investigate. Let's go to that big building way in the back. I I couldn't see a big building way in the back, so okay, there we go. Oh no, that's usually when bad things happen. So is the theory that um, these monsters we're fighting are like mutated foot soldiers? I can't remember the exact story. I mean, like I said, I remember the episodes, but like I don't remember exactly what's going on. I need to track this show down and watch it. I wonder if there's anywhere I can like stream it or anything like that. So if you happen to know that information, that'd be cool if you could share it. Um, here we go. Here we go. We got him. I'm feeling like an unstoppable force of nature that nothing can harm. Except for maybe those two hits that I just received from those guys. Yeah. Cool, that didn't do anything. It was fun, though. Hey, pal. Watch it. Oh, boy, a soda. How you doing there, big guy? You want a soda? Good old family guy quotes coming at you. Get plenty of those watching these videos. Hit. <laughs> But I mean, if you're sticking around for Ninja Turtles episode 17, you're certainly kind of already knowing what to expect. But maybe I like to keep you on your toes, and maybe I'll quote The Simpsons instead. But I haven't watched The Simpsons nearly as much as I have Family Guy, so don't expect any Simpsons quotes coming at you anytime soon. Except for maybe, like, the popular ones of, like, the... Mmm, donut. Something like that. Hey! Stop it. Hey, that was painful. How did you survive that? I barely survived that. Here, what do we get this? Yeah, Makimoto in the corner. We got it, we got it. Charge! Woohoo! You think he gets sick of seeing the same things over and over? Like, they're like having like a fight, and they're like, Donatello, shut up! And then Michelangelo's over there like, uh... Mikeosaurus Rex. Mikeosaurus Rex. Have you ever played this game? That's one of the lines Michelangelo says. It's Mikeosaurus Rex. And it's, he says it a lot. Um, I don't know what Leonardo or Raphael says. I don't think I've ever played as Leonardo or Raphael. Now I think about it. Yeah. The sacrifice was worth it. Here we go. Stay away from me. Wow, there's a lot of things going on here. Let's uh, try to not die. Food? Anyone? Oh, thank goodness for the cheeseburgers. Okay, okay. Shh. Ah, he's so speedy. Ah, ah, ah. Um, I was like, is that light causing problems? And sure enough, it is. Okay. Alright, I appreciate it. Yep, yeah, okay. I mean, that's fine. It's whatever. Just say the same lines over and over again. I mean, you can do whatever you want. Ow, ow, ow. Ow, 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 ow. Okay. Oh, okay. That was inconvenience. Oh. Alright. Well, that works, I guess. Alright. I don't know if I'd be saying alright. I literally just died, so, I mean. 
Not working out so swell for me, is it? Oh, that electricity is still getting us from up there. Cool. Well, this is going really swell. Um, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Calm down. I was like, I gotta, like, clear the space, but this is going very poorly. Okay, not gonna lie. Don't think that we're gonna make it through uh, with two lives. Oof. I don't think we're gonna make it through with one. Okay, we're, we're dead. Okay. Oh boy. All right, we'll see how this goes. I don't, I can't guarantee guarantee anything good. Oh look, food. Oh boy. Yet again, still confused how that sushi doesn't really look like sushi, but I don't eat sushi, so I mean it makes sense. Aha! That one was my fault. I hit the wrong button. So instead of like kind of backing off and hitting the thing, I like stood right in front of it and then did the thing. I still don't know what these guys can do, but I'm glad I don't know because they look really scary with all their polygonal gloriness. Um, who owns Ninja Turtles now? I think it's still Nickelodeon because they have like the really weird Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle cartoon where they wear like full face masks instead of like bandanas. Um, oh no. Oh yeah, that's right because they copyright claimed one of my videos. Actually, it was the very first Ninja Turtle video. They're like, hey, pal, can't show the uh, Ninja Turtles. TV intro on YouTube. How dare you, fiend. Alright, that was only a terrible disaster. That didn't go very well at all. <laughs> okay. I mean, we only have two more levels, but I have a feeling that these last two levels with two lives, so we can only lose one life per level here. And if that's the case, then I will die and I have to start over. So, this level looks really cool, though. Whoa, is this like one of those really like straightforward levels? Just what is going on here? You're in like Space Odyssey. Whoa. Yeah, probably. No, they're all dead. Okay. Maybe it was the monsters. Oh. I'm going to go with a yes on that one. I'm not sure. It looks like the life support systems are partially functional. Yeah, we're gonna go with a yes on that one. Yep, there we go. Yep, they're alive. I guess they're alive. Well, at least those four are. Well, that's good news. For them. Alright, well, now there's only three of them. I mean, that works out really well for me, because then that's less guys I have to fight. But hey, we're just gonna do my thing and beat them up. Because that's the name of the game. Beat them up. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, those are explosive. Or it sure looks like it. Yep, those are explosive. Okay, good to know. Hey, watch it, fellas. I'm over here trying to kick your asses, and they're over there just kicking my ass. It's like, whoa, excuse me, sirs. This is not how the game works. Okay. Here we go. Fire sure again. Here we go. Okay, we gotta get out of here. Yep, yeah, uh, I didn't get out of there fast enough. See, that's what I meant to do earlier, but then, like, it didn't work out so well. They just kept attacking me, and it was really rude. Here we go. Sushi for the win. Okay, okay. <laughs> Stay away. Stay away. Oh, no. Oh, no. Get out of there. Ha, ha, ha. Did it kill him? Nope. Okay, I mean, that's fine. I mean, I would have preferred if it did, but I can't make those decisions at this point. I'm not really in the position to do so. But hey, you know what? Everything's A-OK. -okay. At least I think so. Okay. Alright, alright, okay, alright. <laughs> yeah! Okay, okay. <laughs> Take that! Oh no. Soda! I need that. Soda's important. I actually haven't had a soda in five and a half years. How's that for you guys? Five and a half years without a soda. Not a single sip. Just soda free. Just like soda. And then of course my wife drinks soda all the time and it's like, wow. She was actually the one that got me onto no soda because um, when we first started dating, she was on the high school drill team and she was like, hey, I'm doing no soda. Would you like to do no soda with me? And I was like, yeah, sure. I'm like, I don't need it. 
I've done it before. Like, I did it in junior high. I did no soda for, like, two or three years. And then I got back on to root beer. I love root beer. And, um... So then we started, we started dating, and I did no soda. And I've been on no soda since. But, like, once we graduated high school, she was like, Soda! Because <laughs> she really likes Dr. Pepper. And so she was all for the Dr. Pepper. And so... Good honor, though. Dr. Pepper's pretty swell. All right, well, since we're in the Matrix now, let's uh, hit the pause on here, and we will catch you guys next time on A Game for Your Thoughts. Thanks for watching.